Matt Sean rolling. Ah. Yeah, I know it's in a minute. <laughs> but hey, listen, check this out, man. You know, I haven't came on this platform in, uh, and it's been, it's been a little minute, you know? Um, but I've been working. You feel me? I'm kind of recap what's been going on for the last couple of months. As of November of last year, I have been creeping, you know, more and more into the film industry, especially here in Savannah. That's where I got my first gig to work for the big uh, YouTube group called AMP um, as a production assistant. And, you know, since that, it's kind of been, you know, gravitating because one thing about me is film has always been a big passion of mine. I came into college undecided because I didn't know what I wanted to do. So then, um, you know, I started working with IDST, then I got into theater, and like the love of acting and filmmaking in general is that's what I want to do for the rest of my life. <laughs> you know, and then, you know, it's a really big step for me coming from, you know, undecided to what I do now, to now I'm um, working hand in hand with some very well known people based here in Savannah. We just recently wrapped on about a month at the end of February um, for a film um, called named Origin by the wonderful director, uh, Miss Ava DuVernay. She is the absolute most hand-in-hand -hand person that I've ever worked with doing with directors. So um, I'll basically show you guys how some of the things looked. Can't show you too much, but I'll show you. So basically we have this thing called a call sheet, right? And this basically shows all of the actors, the call sheet for the day, you know what I'm saying? And then we have our direction on the back. And then, you know, with that, that kind of keeps us on track of the time and it has every single aspect. And I didn't realize how much people it really, like, you know, one thing people looked at, they don't look at the credits on the, the movie. But if you sit there and look, there are a lot of people that dedicate their time to make sure, to making sure that a film is made um, at its absolute best. I'm currently working on a TV show now. Um, it's gonna be on, I believe, Netflix. The show is called Clean Slate, uh, which is starring the um, transgender female um, on Orange is the New Black, Laverne, I think, it's, I can't remember her last name, because when you, you, you know the face, <laughs> you know, that's all that matters. We recently just started shooting uh, production got pushed back a little tad bit because of you know some difficulties, but now we're full-fledged running this week I'm kind of taking some time off because of finals and everything and they totally understand a production assistant is someone that you know It sets in the name you are right under the director and the production side of things when it comes to your call sheet So you're under the production side, right? Uh, basically what my job is to do I am in charge of background. I make sure that, you know, the things that I'm doing pertains towards the entire project. Basically, I'm directing background. I'm directing, telling people where to go. You know, sometimes it can be overwhelming because, you know, some some uh, background actors might want to, hey, can you give me a camera? Can you give me a camera? I'm just like, that's not really <laughs> what it is. I got the opportunity to meet Oprah Winfrey. Uh, really, she really scared me when I first saw her, but you know, we had a really good conversation, and it just this the amount of people that I've met uh, Blair Underwood, the lady from Insidious, um, the, the in the most recent season of You, I forget, I for, I for, I'm, I'm still learning names, but I know the face Anjane Ellis, Blair Underwood, John Brenthal, um, you know, a lot of well known actors, and it's just you know, it's kind of like you know. Me, you know, they call the term fanboy, you fanboy, and you're like, hey, can I get a picture? Da, da, da. In this production, you can't really do that. I mean, you can, but that's more so at the end. But, you know, at the end of the day, we're all human, and we build friendships besides the fame and everything. And, you know, that that's, that, that's what everything is about. It's about a team effort to make sure that everything is goes towards the final project. Um, currently in the process of graduating. I graduate in about four days. And I am super ecstatic about that. And I'm just more so excited to see what's the next step gonna be because I'm just, listen, it's, it's up for me. I, I get to fully work full time in the film industry, which is just something that I've always wanted to do since I was 
about 14 years old. Like I said, I, I, I love this industry. It's something that, you know, I always want to do. And, you know, everything about it is just, I love it. Like I said, there's gonna be about five more productions coming here in Savannah, I can't say the names. If you're local to the 912 Savannah area, you would hear about it. That's kind of what's been going on for the last couple of months. You know, I haven't been posting on YouTube as much because I've just genuinely been locked in on my school and you know, making sure that I get to the, the graduation stage. But this is a huge goal. Remember when I first came to college and you know, I was on the track team and I didn't really know what to expect, but um, that molded me into the person I am today. I uh, first started off small hand at my church where I first gained the, the love of film, then I went to college, and then I did photography, and you know, it's, 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 it's nothing but a true blessing. You know, the year has just begun, you know, and there's so much to come, and I think the biggest thing that I am excited about is that next step into my real career. Um, you know, working in the industry full time. Um, whatever your goals is, whatever your dreams are, you can literally achieve them. And I know that might sound very, you know, in one ear and out the other ear, but you literally can make your dreams come true if you put the effort and go find it. Your dream's not gonna find you. You're gonna find your dream. And whatever it is, do not stop. Consistency and uh, obsession always going to beat talent. So that's something that, you know, always to keep into consideration. Um, yeah, I'm just so excited. I'm also, I got my first acting gig as well. Um, it was supposed to be filming, it was supposed to be filmed in May, but it got pushed back to August due to production issues. So, you know, hopefully soon you guys can see my Nate face on the screen. And uh, yeah, man, it's just, it's just so much to come this year, man. But just wanted to update you guys on you know what's been going on and everything and hey, I'm beyond thankful and blessed for everything that I've seen so far not being full time. Just excited to see what, you know, what the year and the years have to bring. So peace out. See you guys on the flip side.